Welcome, uh, this is Arnavo Chaudhary and you are live on my YouTube channel, Arun Foot. Today I want to talk about the Indian Super League and the latest official addition of a club to the ISL. It's club number 13 and as one would have expected, but it took some time, it is... Kolkata Giants Mohammedan Sporting Club. Yes, the Black Panthers are now officially an Indian Super League club. It took, as I said, a little longer than planned, most probably. One would have hoped that the announcement could have been done maybe in June, worst case July. But now we are, yeah, in the latter part of August. The league is supposed to start in mid September. So that's the good news and um, I've done a few videos in the past on the status of Mohammedan Sporting and also of course on Hyderabad FC so currently we are talking about a 13 team league taking place in the 2024-2025 season as the top tier of Indian football. Mohammedan Sporting last season won the I-League and earned the right as champions as the second ever team after what was round glass Punjab, which became Punjab FC last year, to get promoted to the ISL. But it's not just a simple promotion. The ISL has certain set criteria which clubs need to fulfill if they want to play in the ISL. Amongst other things, a certain level of a bank guarantee and ensuring that you have the money to run your operations for a certain period of time. Again, Marvel Sporting won the I League with. 52 points, 15 wins last season. Quite impressive numbers. And um, the Black Panthers are back in the top tier of Indian football. They haven't had the best of runs during the I-League days when the I-League was the top tier. Very often promoted and then relegated again. Have had a very good run in the last few years. Always being yeah one of the top teams in the league. And uh, now... They make the step up. Now they have to sign, especially foreign players who will be stronger than the usual foreigners that they would have signed for the I-League. They've brought in some interesting Indian players. Lately, former India junior captain Amarjit Kiam, who of course last season what was with Punjab FC. So Mohan and Sporting have the task cut out. They are set not to play at the Salt Lake Stadium as the third team besides Mohan Bagan Super Giants and East Bengal FC, but rather will pick the smaller Kishore Bharati Stadium in um, yeah, the southern, southeastern fringes of the city um, on the close to the Eastern Bypass. So this is the situation from my side. Congratulations, Mohammedan Sporting. Congratulations, Black Panther fans. Great to see you now as an ISL team and yeah let's see if it will be a 13 team league or if something happens around Hyderabad FC and I'll keep you certainly updated here either in a separate video or in my lives as always if you've liked what you've just seen and heard like share and subscribe to Arun Foot here on YouTube visit my other social medias visit ironfoot.com as well and I'll be back very, very soon. So now Chaudhary signing off. Bye for now.